What's up YouTube guys, Charlie here. Today we're looking at a DVR kit, a DVR security kit from a company called Hem Vision. And this guy is on Amazon. I will leave all the description for you guys down below where to find this. Um, I've reviewed some of their products before. I will show you one of them I have outside. I have a, a wireless rechargeable one outside that lasts six months. Um, easy, to, easy to put up. No wire needed, but this one is a wired DVR. This is the HM245 kit. This has four cameras, a DVR. One thing is that the DVR doesn't have a hard drive, so you're gonna have to get a hard drive to put in there. It's very simple. You can just get a, uh, you can get up to a six terabyte hard drive to put in there. So that's a lots of recording you can put on there. Uh, this is HD five megapixel, um, human shape detection, motion detection, um, night vision. IP66 waterproof, email alerts, video loss alerts, um, remote viewing, face detection, and somebody blocked the camera like this, it's gonna actually send you a message letting you know somebody blocked your camera. So here we go guys, this is everything that comes. So you have your four camera screws and everything you need to, um, to install your cameras. Here you have four 60 foot wires with everything you need to plug it in. So you have your infinite cable and your mouse, you have your DVR right here. Um, you have your power supply, you have your manual. So guys, when you set this up, if you want to record any kind of um, recording on this, you're gonna have to get a hard drive to put in there. I think I have a hard drive here, so we're gonna probably put it in there and you guys will see how this works. But here you go guys, you have your DVR right there. You have all your lights and indicating lights at the front, recording, power, your alarm, your IR area right there. At the back, within it here, you have eight channels and for your four cameras on there. So you can add four more cameras, so you can have up to eight cameras hooked up on there. You have your audio in, your audio out, you have your VGA and your HDMI out. Um, you have two USB, um, that's where you plug in your your power supply here yeah, that's how you pour this on um you have your infinite connection where you can connect your internet wire right in so we're gonna install a hard drive on this there is four screws there we have to get rid of them so um that's the first thing we want to do is to unscrew the four screws so the four screws is out we're gonna open this up just slide it out and um, just like that so here we have our two connection if it's a used hard drive like what i'm using right now um make sure you format it first this is a 512 gig hard drive, so not a pretty big one, but you can go up to six um, terabytes on these. So you can go as big as you want. The, the bigger it is, is better. And um, it's the longer that your stuff stay on there and it wouldn't have to record over it. Push it in there. And basically that's it. I'm talking back on. You put your cover back, back your four screws, and you're basically, you're done guys. At the back here, you can connect your mouse. So you have your power supply, you're going to plug it in right there. For your four cameras, you get your other power supply. It's going to plug in this one here, and then you can power your four different cameras. So, so you're going to get your camera, you're going to mount up this side here just like that. And then this end here goes just like that behind there, and this end goes into here, goes into one of your splitters. So you have four splitters. So you're gonna start putting your cameras in there. So all the red ones goes into this one here. So guys, after everything is plugged in, um, I'm gonna use my HDMI. I'm gonna use the HDMI out in there to plug into my monitor. So you can use a VGA, it's gonna plug into a computer monitor. But I'm gonna use my HDMI, I'm gonna plug this in. And then we're gonna put on the power on here. So the, the drive is format, we're gonna click OK. So in the startup wizard, you want to just click next so it's recommending that you put all your cameras on make sure it's working plug in and everything and then you go to your next um set up your time wherever wherever your time zone is you're going to set it up you click next you want to check your gateway and let's keep retrying if it doesn't work just take it out and plug it in um behind behind the D dvr box and make sure everything is working is working we go to next yeah, you're going to make sure that you download the app. Guys. You want to go to the app store, you want to download an app called X, XMI. You want to download that app, open it, set it up. When you set it up, it's going to ask you at one point to scan your, your serial number. So you're going to put it on there, you're going to scan. And when you scan it, and you have it, you're going to log in again. It's going to send you a, a code, you're going to put it in. 
and then we go from there you're gonna click next it's just gonna walk you through it here we go we click next and then you have successfully um, set up everything and click OK. So yeah, so everything is set up. Um, you can see on both screens here. Uh, I think we have a little, we had a movement here, so that's where. That, so we had a little bit of movement somewhere over there. So the screen came up, uh, but you can click on here and go into your four channels, or you can go into here or go into your eight channels if you have your eight cameras on there. But um, yeah, you can see our screen here. I have two of them on the outside. So you can see where the infrared cameras will come on at night. So you got you have night vision, almost like night vision on here. On, on top of those two cameras here is inside right now. On the, so the light. So that's why it's so bright and nice right now. Um, I like, I like, oh yeah. So you can, you have lots of control on here. You can record, you can do all kind of stuff. You can see cars passing down there. I can, I can also kind of just map out your area. If I see something suspicious, in an area so let's say i see that car right there i can map it out and then kind of zoom in on it on there so i like that feature um lots of stuff on there lots of stuff to play with you can go in you can right click go into your main menu your um, your recording mode um in recording mode you can go in there and choose what which to schedule and do all kind of stuff in there um you can also go in playback um if there's a date or something you want to search for so like right now I can click OK on that. I can go in here and I can see you can see I can I can just run the mouse right there and you can see it, it gives me um, all the recording right here on the on the red areas and I can actually click on it and all these here will be recordings and you can see I have a bunch of recordings on there outside earlier outside. This is this is really good and like I said it's eight channels so you can add more channels on here and you can see if you add eight channels how it will look. You can have one main screen and eight cameras here, but now we only have four of them there, guys. So I this is really good. Um, the app is pretty good too. Same, same thing with the app, you have lots of control. Hello, hello, hello. So you can actually through the app, you can you can talk to a person that's looking at that screen right now. So you can take screenshot, guys, you can record on there um, sideways and have all four screens there. And you can go back and look at all the different um, recordings that you had. Open it up and you can see I have a recording right there. And you can again do four screens if you had, if you had nine screens, if you had 16 channels, but now we only have four. Um, change from SD to HD. Um, can I change this mode? Guys, really good. I will leave all the link and everything for you guys down in the description. Check it out, guys. Check it out. And let's go back to our four channels. Just like that. And check out the night on the outside. Guys, this is Charlie. Like and subscribe. I'm out.
I'm gonna go ahead and connect my internet, my internet.